Shan does transgender voice clinics to help transgender people, in a sense, have the voice that matches their gender identity. I think the difference it makes to trans people to have a voice that they feel comfortable with and reflects their gender is absolutely invaluable. It's often the difference between um, a happy life and an unhappy one and for some people it's a difference between life and death if you think about the, the negative impact that it can have on someone's mental health. It also teaches things like resonance and like body language which a lot of people don't think about. They just think that if they go higher they sound more feminine or go lower they sound more masculine but sometimes it doesn't sound right. So all the activities that it teaches, the safe ways in which they can slowly move the gender spectrum of their voice without damaging their focal folds. If you're trying to portray yourself as one particular gender, your voice has got so much for, for that instant recognition. It, it means it's, it's pretty much the foundation, I would have said, for being able to live, live successfully. I always thought I'd be stuck with the voice I've got because I couldn't afford to do private therapy. Um, but it's given me the... the it's insight to show that I can, I can change my voice. Sean's done a fantastic thing by bringing some of the knowledge and expertise uh, from the university setting into the community setting where trans people can actually tangibly really benefit from his expertise and his skills. It's just not just focused on his job, it's focused on helping the community as well. Anyone in his position working in the university he could easily set a weekend clinic up and charge patients but out of the goodness of his heart, he's doing it for free. I've just admiration for the man for, for, what, for what he does for so many people. It's, 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 no, there's no, no words really to describe how, how much he's giving to people. I've never known anyone um, be so generous with their time, their knowledge, their expertise. One of the things that's impressed me so much about Sean is his willingness to learn from others. And I think he would say himself that he isn't an expert in, in the lives of trans people, but what he does do is he sits and he listens and he, he really wants to learn about trans people as much as he knows that he's got skills and tools that he can teach them. So, and I think that makes him particularly worthy um, of an award like this. It was invaluable, the workshop. Obviously, I've got a lot of work to do with my voice, but just to be able to change it and know that I can change it safely it means everything, it means everything. And for someone to do it, from the goodness of the heart, it was, it was brilliant. Before going to the workshop, I was, I was very isolated. Um, and to be in a room with some other people in the same situation as me, gave me that connection to show that I'm not on my own. Um, and that, yeah, I've got a lot of work to do, but it is possible to change my voice. Um, so there is something to work for, something to look forward to.